What's up, fight fans? I'm Jay Cotto, and welcome to the Boxing and Jedi's Temple. And today, well, we're gonna do a little something different on boxing news. Bro, not one, not two, but three fucking failed tests. GW uh, 1516, HGH, and now EPO? Now, if that isn't a fucking drug addict, I don't know what else is. If that isn't a fucking cheater, I don't know what else is. This should go beyond suspension. This should go like a permanent fucking ban. Like baby Gerald Miller, baby HGH, EPO, GW1516, baby Miller, you don't belong in boxing, brother. You could try that shit over at UFC where they piss hot every motherfucking event, but not here, brother. Three tests in one shot, you failed. That's enough for you to say, you know what? I don't belong here. First, you, 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 you fucking, you talk to fucking Eddie Hearn, and you tell Eddie Hearn, oh, I swear, I'm innocent, and he gave you the benefit of the doubt. Then when the second one came out, what the fuck happened? What happened? You failed that one. Then a third one? And then you want to make a video? I messed up. I'm missing out on an opportunity. No shit. No shit. Now, in conclusion to this bullshit, how many of y'all feel strongly that he does not belong in this sport at all? I mean, to do something like this, you could have you could have injured Anthony Joshua, and you even came out and was like, "Oh, braggadocious!" Dylan White blew your spot up, son, and came out with the fuck. Eh, eh. Ah, I'm gonna kill this motherfucker. So you had mean intentions, then you son of a bitch. I will be more than happy ever if I ever see you like to tell you in your face you're a fucking cheat, and millions of fight fans will be more than happy to tell you too. You needed help. You ain't have nothing for Joshua. But here you were talking, then you shoved the man. I already knew you was on something because of your fucking bitch mood swings. So I don't think that you belong at all in the sport of boxing at all, my man. You need to take a permanent vacation, man. Do you know what I'm saying? You need to get the fuck out of boxing, man. Do you know what you're doing, man? Do you know? You put in fucking people. The health man, you put it in a fucking risk man. Do you know what you are man? You're a fucking hassle man. Okay? You're a piece of shit man. Do you know? I'll tell you myself man. Do you don't belong here man. Do you know? How do they say man? In rap man, how they say? Your arms are too short to box with the guard man. Do you know what I'm saying? So, I don't want to hear anything else about Baby Miller. I don't want to hear no motherfucking excuses. I don't want to hear anything that pertains to Big EPO G1516 HGH using Baby Miller. I don't, I don't, I don't. And if I see this motherfucker boxing in six months, I'm writing a letter. <laughs> I'm writing a fucking letter. Otherwise than that, get the fuck out of boxing. Now, please. Happy 420 to everybody. I'm your boy, Jay Cotto, telling the truth from the sport of boxing, Star Wars, and the movie world. Hashtag come back to boxing. May the force be with you. God bless. Stay vigilant. Peace. And happy birthday, Gypsy. Happy birthday, bro.